Well, hello everybody and welcome to another edition of Super Sunday here on Sunday's Gaming. It's another quarter-final of the Celebrity FIFA Cup today between fictional characters and forgotten celebrities. What a match this is going to be, Alan Smith. Yup. Well, both teams have got absolutely amazing squads being showcased for today's match. We can't wait to bring this to you. Join us next and it's more. <laughs> Now the starting lineup for fictional characters. Rubius Hagrid is in goal, and it's a back five of Benjamin Button, the Go Compare Man, Walter White, Mikey from Reset, and Lord Farquaad. Three in the midfield: Alan Partridge, Pat Butcher, and Tommy Shelby. And up top together is Rumpel Stiltskin and Mr. Tumble. What a starting lineup it is for fictional characters, you have to say, Alan Smith. Oh, yeah, well, Mr. Tumble, he's a key man. He can entertain children, but can he entertain us? Starting for the forgotten celebrity side, in goal is Susan Boyle. Back four of Darius, Daniel Bedding. Field, David Hasselhoff and Bradley from S Club. Mr. T is sitting in defensive midfield with Soldier Boy and Marcel either side of him. Bam Margera in attacking midfield and it's Rick Astley and Wagner as the deadly strike duo up front. Marcel uh, on the left-hand side from Blazing Squad and Soldier Boy. You had to say two real key players for them today. Oh, two great musicians, unforgettable. Oh, actually not really but yeah they could be good footballers as well but I guess we'll have to find out won't we? So we kick off here at Bramall Lane and uh, this is going to be a fantastic quarter-final between fictional characters and forgotten celebrities and already what a massive challenge that was from Marcel from Blazing Squad. Uh, really disgusting you had to say inside the first minute and it's already a yellow card. Oh, yeah. There's a flip reversed in there I think that's dirty from Marcel. Walter White into the midfield to Pat Butcher. Uh, who can oh, release a, a long range shot you know she can what oh. effort as well and it's hit the crossbar goodness me what a strike from Pat Butcher oh that was sensational and she can act but that was all real here's Wagner looking to find Rick Astley who uh, might be looking to go forward here but it's a great challenge Pat Butcher started the game off superbly well and there she is again oh, she's lost the plot I think she's gone one today <laughs> Wagner with a chance here maybe oh. and a good save from Hagrid he's onto the rebound can he turn it in well Hagrid's oh. there again Wagner looking dangerous and Hagrid equal to the task as he just puts the ball down and looks to dribble it out he finds Tommy Shelby or does he well he does just about Shelby now finds Lord Farquaad and here's Mr Tumble into Rumpel Stiltskin mm. who's got past the challenge it was a lunging tackle and uh, not very well timed either oh. but in the end well Bradley from S Club great defending there mm. yeah, you say Stiltskin can turn anything into gold it looks like he just turned that into shit Bradley from S Club now with a bit of space down the left hand side he's looking for Marcel who takes it well and he's got past Benjamin Button Marcel maybe looking to get Ooh. across in here he plays it in it's a chance oh, and what a save what a it is save. from Hagrid Rick Astley with a shot but Hagrid that's fantastic goalkeeping oh yeah it's one thing to be a groundskeeper but another thing to be a goalkeeper but you can't see the difference here Soldier Boy picks it up and is looking to do something on the left hand oh. side but he's absolutely taken out there by Tommy Shelby that was a horrible challenge that was an awful challenge by order of the Peaky Blinders! And it will result in another yellow card as well. Tommy Shelby taken into the book by the referee here, the Go Compare Man, just telling him to calm down. Can be a bit hot headed, can't you, on the pitch, Tommy Shelby? Yeah, he can, and off the pitch as well. Earlier I saw him slap a donkey! Well, Bam Margera is standing over the free kick here. We know he's a bit of a specialist. It's Bam Margera looking for the top corner, oh. but Hagrid, well, his uh, giant frame didn't have any trouble getting to that ball as he catches it and smashes it downfield to absolutely nobody. What is that? Susan Boyle, oh my goodness me, what a horrendous first touch and she just about got away with it. Now David Hasselhoff playing it into midfield, here's Mr T looking to find Bam Margera. Now Ashley into Wagner, nice little move this as Wagner maybe looks to get the shot in, tries to chip it over, he gets another chance here. Ooh. Oh, but it's a poor shot in the end for Wagner. Yeah, well, he doesn't really have the X factor and he's crap. Go compare man taking it forward from centre back here and gets past the challenge. Now here's Alan Partridge looking for Benjamin Button down the right hand side and now Rumpel Stiltskin finding Mr Tumble. Tumble it's a great turn for Mr Tumble he's going to shoot oh! oh it's a brilliant finish as well Mr Tumble picks out the top corner and uh, well Susan Boyle had absolutely no chance nothing she could do and he loves kids <laughs> <laughs> he loves kids but he'll love that goal even more so 1-0 to fictional characters their main man Mr Tumble with the goal and now forgotten celebrities have got to try and drag themselves back into this game. But Rumpel Stiltskin here has found Alan Partridge. And he's got a lot of space down this right-hand side. David Hasselhoff looks to stop him. The cross goes in. Daniel Beddingfield gets it clear. But it's called back for a free kick. Hasselhoff with a late challenge there. Tommy Shelby looking to take it forward down the left-hand side. He cuts in, finds Alan Partridge. And the run's been made through here by Rumpel Stiltskin. Daniel Beddingfield can't dispossess him. It's Rumpel Stiltskin. Oh. What a save, though, from Susan Boyle. Well, a massive chance there for Rumpel Stiltskin. Yeah, could have been a fairy tale ending. 
but it wasn't. Well, Susan Boyle clearly regained her focus after her anal bump party earlier today. And here's Bam Margeri now looking for Rick Astley. Chance here for Astley. Great save oh. from Hagrid. And the rebound is saved again. Well, Rubius Hagrid is having a fantastic game so far. There's no getting past him. Oh, no. And you know, Astley says, never going to give you up. Never going to let you down. You just have, Rick. Can play the corner in. Hagrid comes out for it and gets a punch to the ball. Bam Margera hits it back in there though. David Hassel. Oh! oh, what an effort. And it smashed off the post. Well, that would have been sensational from Hasselhoff. Oh, it would have been, but it didn't go in. Marcel Somerville throws it into David Hasselhoff, who was so unlucky with that shot. And now Mr. T playing it to Darius on the right hand side. Back to Mr. T. Now Wagner looking to work the space to get the ball into the box here. Wagner plays it in far post. Rick Astley! Oh, oh what a chance! And he's put it wide again. I can't believe that. I can't believe it! Hagrid with the goal kick forward up towards uh, Rumpelstiltskin, but David Hasselhoff does tower over him. And now here's Bam Margera looking not to make a jackass of himself here as he finds Rick Astley. Bit of space ahead of him here. He's looking to maybe find Wagner. Goes instead to Mr. T, who hits it first time. It's blocked, but it comes out to Soldier Boy now. Looking to get across in here. Can he get it back onto his left foot? He can. Plays it in towards the far post, but it's massively overhit and headed clear. Well, there's the half time whistle. 1 0 at the break, but a frantic first half. Lots of chances at both ends. Oh yeah, definitely, and I can't wait for the second half, because then I can go home! And now, ladies and gentlemen, it is time to announce the winner of the Gary Glitter is Crap Comment Contest, chosen at random from over a thousand comments. The winner is our resident Cockney! Congratulations, sir, you have won the chance to choose a player to appear in the Celebrity FIFA Cup Final. We'll be getting in touch with you to arrange who you want to be in there and to congratulate you on your victory. But well done, everybody. Commiserations to everybody that didn't win. There'll be more competitions soon, however. But in the meantime, let's get back to the action. Well, a half-time substitution by both teams. Walter White is going off to be replaced by Mr. Bean for fictional characters. And Darius goes off in place of him comes Snooky on the right-hand side of the defence. Wagner, lovely little turn from him. And here's Margera again. They're coming out strong at the start of the second half as uh, Rick Astley oh. looks to go in. But Hagrid again. Brilliant goalkeeping from him. Well, I think he's been man of the match so far. Rick Astley looks to turn here and he does. Mr. Bean can't win it back. And now Mr. T looking to launch a oh. shot here. Great effort again. And it's just wide of the post. Oh, pity the fool who tries to save that. Soldier Boy has been released down the right hand side again. Looking to use his pace once more. Tommy Shelby dives in but can't win it. And he's played oh. it through here. And Rick Astley could be onside. But oh, Hagrid again. Poor, fast off his line. Poor, poor pass. And Soldier Boy, I'd expect a lot better from you. Lord Farquaad now taking it down into space on the left hand side. He plays the cross in, dealt with, uh, but it's more up than out from David Hasselhoff. It's flicked on now to Tommy Shelby. Could be a chance for oh. Shelby, but a good save there. Alan Partridge to take this corner from the left hand side. It's drifted in, but headed well away. And uh, Snooky looks to take it down here. She's done very well as well to hold the ball up. Snooky, oh, who Snooky. is only five foot one, looking to cause something here. Rick Hassey picks it up now, and uh, Marcel oh, oh. in a bit of space to the left hand side Bang takes it. a touch. He's going to shoot. Oh! Oh. What a goal! Marcel Somerville! Oh my goodness me! Well, that tops anything he's done in his career previously, including with Blazing Squad. What a strike! Well, that's not difficult. I can't believe that. He's had a crossroads in his mind, but he just goes for it and bang! One all! Well, that is absolutely inspirational from Marcel Somerville. What an absolute banger. And Rubius Hagrid, as good as he's been today, had no chance with that. Well, straight after that goal, fictional characters responding with a double change. Mikey and Rumpelstiltskin both leave the field and Bob the Builder and Forrest Gump are coming on to it. Wagner is also off for Forgotten Celebrities and Jay Sean comes on up front. Bob the Builder, fresh legs on at centre-back, finding Tommy Shelby, who's looking to spark something in the middle here. Mr. Tumble bringing it forward and looking for a bit of inspiration himself. He goes for oh. goal! Oh my goodness, it was so close again. Well, some of the shooting we've been seeing in this game has been phenomenal and almost another fabulous goal. Well, some of it's been amazing, and, and others, well, ah! Alan, you seem a bit twitchy today, I have to say. I, I, I know you've been trying to stay off the uh, the strong stuff for a little bit. How's it all been going? Oh, I've got no idea what you're talking about. Well, I just I remember one of the last games you were in the commentary booth, you snorted a line about halfway through and uh, no, had, wasn't had me. to leave. It wasn't you? No. Oh. Okay, so, but you haven't touched it since then. No, the only thing I've touched, actually, I won't finish that sentence. Mr. Tumble now with the ball, finding Alan Partridge. Forrest Gump making the run ahead of them here. Oh, and he's got there as well, ahead of David Hasselhoff. Forrest Gump with a huge chance. Oh, oh but he didn't want to shoot. He just wanted to run. Shoot, Forrest, shoot! 
Jay Sean smashing a fabulous ball over to the right hand side and Soldier Boy can keep it in. Couple in support if he wants to play the cross in. He goes near post and it's dealt with well in the end by the defence. Now Tommy Shelby, 14 minutes of normal time left for somebody to find a winner in this game as Tommy Shelby brings it forward, gets past Snooky and he's looking to play oh, in Forrest Gump quick. who's got acres of space here and he's got the pace to get there as well. Forrest Gump turns inside, plays it in. Tommy Shelby! Oh, oh it was a massive chance and Shelby just lost his composure. David Hasselhoff finds Bradley from S Club and down the left-hand side, him and Marcel have looked fantastic so far today. Jay Sean off the bench, picking out Bam Margera. Bit of space for him to run into maybe as he turns back inside, finds Rick oh. Astley. Lovely back heel and here's Jay Sean oh. and the game has turned on its head. Jay Sean off the bench for Forgotten Celebrities has scored what could be the winning goal. Oh, well, one thing he does there well, he just keeps it down and bang, that's 2-1. Well, Jay Sean really was getting down with that celebration. Absolutely fabulous goal off the bench as well in the 82nd minute. He's made a real impact for forgotten celebrities who look like they could be going through to the semi-finals. Well, the clock ticking over 90 minutes into stoppage time and Michael Owen's on the touchline for us with some observations about the game. Michael, what do you reckon? Well, football's all about scoring goals and one team scored two goals, the other team scored one goal. David Hasselhoff intercepts and plays it clear to Soldier Boy and if he can just keep the ball here that might be game over. Soldier Boy getting past the challenges and uh, doing really well with it here. Pat Butcher in the end intercepts it and finds Tommy Shelby but time is oh. up. The full time whistle has been blown. It's another incredible comeback here in the Celebrity FIFA Cup and forgotten celebrities have come back from a goal down to defeat fictional characters 2-1. Jane Sean with the winning goal after an absolute stunner from Marcel from Blazing squad and uh, Mr. Tumble, of course, getting the goal for fictional characters in the first half, but it wasn't enough. What a game, Alan Smith! Oh, great game. I'm tired now and I do need a nap, but uh, I'm sure I'll get my energy back for the next one and I will be excited. Well, remember, guys, if you're watching right now, be sure to vote on your player of the match in the top right hand corner of the video. There'll be a little link you can click and you can decide your player of the match. We'll reveal the winner and uh, how the uh, tables are looking, goal scorers, all that sort of thing on the Wednesday Roundup show here on Sunnage Gaming. But until then, we hope you've enjoyed this episode of Super Sunday. Who are you thinking are going to win the Celebrity FIFA Cup from the teams that you've seen so far? Leave a comment below with who you're supporting and backing to get all the way to the trophy. Until next time, though, this is me, Sunnage Gaming, signing out with Alan Smith as well. Thank you very much for watching. Bye-bye.